Hello everyone, this is Mike. Welcome to my channel, Mike the Tech Savvy. In this video, I will be comparing the Xiaomi Mi Band 3 versus the Mi Band 4 or Mi Smart Band 4. And I will try to answer the question, is it worth upgrading to the Smart Band 4 if you already own the Mi Band 3? The box itself has been changed. Indeed, this Mi Band 3 is a Chinese version, but still, the design has changed a bit. You can see the specs here on the back for the Mi Band 3. In case of the Mi Band 4, we have the new box, which is like more colorful and more modern. And the specs, or at least some part of them. Let's just go inside. Here is the Mi Band 3 and the charger. The Mi Band 4 is on my wrist. This is my activity tracker, daily driver. Here are the two wristbands, one next to another, and the chargers. Let's start off by talking about the charging situation. So for the Mi Band 3, you had to put this on a charger like this, and then stick it into a USB port, and that was it. For this new Mi Band 4, you have to place these pins here, like this. It's a different approach and yeah, in this case the pins were a bit more protected for the Mi Band 3, but both approaches are pretty good if you ask me. I believe that uh, Xiaomi have really done a good job, as opposed to Fitbit for example, which has a much more sensitive charging situation. What's similar about these two is that you have the same straps. So if you had like multiple straps for the Mi Band 3 and you bought a lot of them, you can still use them for the Mi Band 4, which is really nice. So the design changes aren't so great, but we still do have some design changes. I will keep on the left the Mi Band 3 and on the right the new one, the Smart Band 4. So as you can see, the left one is a bit more curved, the display is kind of curved as well. On the bottom here, we do have a different heart rate sensor implementation. Look at the first one and look at the new one. The biggest change out of all aesthetically at least, is the display. Right off the bat, you can see that the Smart Band 4 has a color display, while the old one only has a monochrome display. If you're looking at the display alone, yes, it's definitely worth upgrading. It's about 40% larger, and you have a lot of new clock faces, so customizability definitely is another win for the Smart Band 4. The price point, I guess they cost more or less the same, so this is kind of out of the question or even if they don't, it's a very small difference. I think the um, Smart Band 4 right now is around 30 US dollars or something like that, which is very cheap given what this device can achieve. As far as weight goes, the Smart Band 4 weighs around 2 grams extra, which is nothing in this world of uh, smart wristbands. Features are more or less the same, so both devices can track sleep, monitor the heart rate during the day, count the steps, check notifications, alarms, something like that. But this one has a better implementation, so let me just give you a quick example. If you go into alarms here, you can see the alarms that I've set up with the phone and you can activate the alarms directly through here. With the previous one you couldn't do that, you can only do it via the app. Of course you have the weather here, for the previous one you didn't have weather or I think you had it but it, it was a much worse implementation. Yeah, I guess you had it after all. They are both water resistant to 50 meters which is more than enough for swimming, surfing, but not much more. I wouldn't suggest you diving with it or something like that. And what's really nice is that this Smart Band 4 has a 6-axis accelerometer and gyroscope, which is really useful if you go swimming. They say that you can track a lot of swimming styles and 
yeah, I, I tried that and I couldn't really, well, I either don't know how to swim or this one doesn't work that good at tracking the actual swimming. They both have a similar battery life. They promise 20 days, but in case of this one, I had a very good, very good surprise from Xiaomi. And for me, at least in my usage scenario, it lasts much longer than 20 days. Also, as far as the technology goes, the SmartBand 4 has Bluetooth 5.0, while this one only has 4.2. This, in theory, should bring a stronger connection and a greater, let's say, range compared to the previous generation. Overall, I would say that the Mi Band 4 is not a revolution, it's an evolution, but a very good one. It is definitely an upgraded version of this, the Mi Band 3, which was pretty good at its time. It has better display, improved sensors and a lot more powerful hardware. And if you have to choose between these two, it's a no-brainer to go for this one. So Smart Band 4 is the way to go if you're faced with this choice. Even though it might seem a little bit more expensive, but a few dollars and my usage at least are worth it. Really, this band can show you a lot more. You can do a lot more stuff with it. You can customize it more. It's basically what you want from a wristband like this. Now that we got to this conclusion, I guess it's time to end this video. I had here a comparison between the Xiaomi Mi Band 3 and the Smart Band 4. The Smart Band 4 is definitely the better choice up until the launch of the Smart Band 5. Thank you so much for watching this video. This was Mike the Tech Savvy. If you liked it, please do press the thumbs up button. If you'd like to see more similar videos in the future, also press the subscribe button, which will be displayed right here in the bottom left part. As always, thank you so much and see you next time. Bye!